Good day YouTube, it's me here, Sketchblitz, coming to you with another video. I just felt like uploading this one because I was on a roll lately and I kinda wanna get this done before the burnout kicks in. <laughs> well, um, this is the first video that I was thinking of trying with my uh, animated character update and I'm a little curious to see how it turns out. So for today's video, I'm just going to be playing Orasio a little bit, um, seeing if I can survive past the first few minutes. It should be fun. Um, <laughs> uh, hopefully it'll be fun, I honestly don't know. And, uh, <laughs> well, yeah, I'm just going to have a blast playing this if I can, and if not, then I'm just going to, uh, <laughs> rage quit, I guess. But it should be fun, so, um... Yeah, let's get right into the video. Um, this is the first time that I'm going to try animating with my character present in the video, at least in the intro so far. I'm just gonna, let's see. I'm gonna die. <laughs> I am going to die. No matter how many times I play this game, I just keep dying. Let's see. To pick the one that's the most aggressive, but also the most logical. Um, I apologize for the mouse clicking and whatnot. I still have not fully updated my uh, setup. It's going to be a while, honestly. Um, I might do a H2O Delirious to make it a couple of years, actually. No guarantees, basically. Great, so I get a powerful, I get attacked by two powerful players right off the bat. Let's see how long I can survive like this. I spawned in the top left corner of the map, which generally is where everyone else is. Hmm. This should be doable. I plan on making this video at most uh, 20 minutes. Let's see uh, if anyone can make me choose to make it less than 20 minutes. <laughs> I see that TFS reference in the leaderboard. Vegeta going, that's it, everyone dies. <laughs> oh, great, I almost just got killed. Nope, nope, nope. Why are, th why are there two of them in the same... I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get mad. I'm not gonna get mad. I expected this. The entire server is overloaded. Hmm. I can't do much of anything with the current takes I was taking. Let's see. I'm just going to troll it and run it down center map. Um, let's see. So um a few days passed since my last bout of videos, and I thought, what if I uploaded League of Legends? You know, just a little bit. Those of you who are fully committed to League of Legends know that there's no such thing as a little bit of League of Legends content. <laughs> Once you start playing, it's uh, pretty hard to kick. I'm honestly not too new to the game, but I was never really playing in the meta either. Frankly, I kind of suck, <laughs> but I guess it would be more entertaining to see someone else fail than uh, failing yourself trapped in a 40 minute long lobby. Oh, hi team. Yeah, but I'm just uh, considering the idea for a little bit. Hmm. You know, it's a little odd having zero subscribers, like, I've been on other websites with social media, but it's always intriguing when you can just do things without people following your every move. Like, actually, I should kill this guy. Yep, yep, I still got it. I still steal kills. <laughs> what am I doing? I'm committing suicide. I can't be up here. Hmm. Okay, let's... 
Yeah, let's stay away from that corner of the map entirely. I'm still 90% sure that it's um, Death Incarnate. I find it a little curious. Rossio has the Mega Smasher, but Daipio has banned it. If Rossio could find a day, if Rossio could, uh, mm, my tongue. If this game could find a way to balance the Mega Smasher, then why couldn't the original? It's uh, a little curious about that. Daipio did come out before Rossio, right? I'm not just uh, making that assumption. Uh, well, regardless, whichever one it came out of, one of them clearly did it better than the others because Daipio has completely removed it from their meta. Hmm. You know what? This is boring. And I am literally walled off from the entire upper half of the map because there's just this giant gray wall. I'm going to see if this guy's going to kill me. Yep, kill me, kill me, kill me. No, I don't want you to be my friend. I want you to kill me. <sighs> this guy gets it. Okay, let's make something a little bit more fun, at least for my sake. <laughs> let's Yeah, you're waiting to destroy me, aren't you? Yep, yep. I'm stuck down here again. Oh well. That's a lot of damage. Wow. Oh, hey, it's the guy that killed me before. Bye. <laughs> uh, I like how this game just takes rock, paper, scissors, and they add other like facets to the design, but they still make it rock, paper, scissors at the end. Like, if you get a drone user, well, if you get a drone tank, you are basically busted for the full game, but if you get a bullet spammer, like... <laughs> At least you have some defense against them. Drone users are still pretty broken. Disturbing habit about this game is how trappers are actually extremely meta. Like, in Daipio, I noticed that you couldn't really do much with them unless you were in team mode because you'd get killed all the time. But here, there is a tank that shoots traps in the form of a machine gun. And it is very, very unnerving. He's shooting me and I hardly feel it. Oh, I feel it. I feel it. My gosh. Did I just get tag teamed? Okay, let's try accommodating for that difference in power. I'm going to be try some trying something a little bit more aggressive and a little bit less evasive this time. Let's see. Hmm. The, I believe that the, uh, yeah, I believe that the mortar, honestly, would be the best, yeah, definitely, oh my gosh, I, I'm an idiot, I started moving without fully upgrading my, okay, it worked, it worked, I can still get this done, let's see how this turns out. I'm honestly still experimenting with this game. Oh my gosh, I hate when that happens. Something else I noticed about this game is that the maps are actually relatively larger than Diapio or Diapio. Basically, kill him, IO, but 
the family friendly name, I guess. I don't know what made them settle on die when the game is about tanks, but well, that's their decision. Frankly, I'm thinking of playing the other IO games after a while, but um, that might be a big if to see, well, what they're capable of. Yeah, this has a lot more firepower. Oh, hey, it's the guy that killed me earlier. If I had gotten the beekeeper, I probably could have hunted him down. Nope, he's killing me. Yep. Go single tank. Make sure that he has maximum movement speed. Yeah, that's. Uh, I guess that's customary. Kind of sucks. There are a lot of offensive tanks around here, so I guess I'm going to try playing more defensively this time. Well, I call it defensively, but honestly it's just throwing more drones at people. Well, looks like someone got killed, but that aside, let's see. I gotta find a corner of the map to just camp in and wait until everyone just kills over, because there are way too many people on this server. It kind of bites back to um, destroy all of the pentagons and whatnot because they kind of act as a wall once they get large enough but it's also a double-edged sword I could stay in here but I don't have any escape routes hmm. let's see there's no easy way to escape in this map if you get cornered wow that's actually pretty annoying or at least I haven't found them yet. Guess I'll go look. You know, you'd think that, like, being able to reach level 45 just by pressing one key 45 times, like just pressing in 45 times, it would make it easier to get on the leaderboard. It's really not. It's really not. All of those people up there, they've got this. They look like they've got this pact going where. <laughs> The guy named That's It Everyone Dies is letting people live. I feel like that's a little bit mafia-esque, but hey, it's a game about killing each other. Let's see if I can destroy this without anyone stealing it. Yep, that one just exploded outward, but... Honestly, sometimes this tank is the only one I'm good at just because all the other ones have too much firepower behind them. Like, I don't know what it is. I just choke and I suddenly aim the wrong direction and someone kills me by one bullet. Like... Although I guess that's a lot of players. I guess that's probably why bullet spammers are so popular. <laughs> the, only the sweats use um, overlords and drones. Which I guess I'm kind of a sweat. Yeah, I guess I'm kind of a sweat, but at the same time, I'm still a casual. Hmm. I'm a sweaty casual. A filthy casual. Yeah, it looks like my theory was right after all. When I attack these things, they keep moving toward me to try to crush me against the wall. Well, at least this one got stuck. Yep, 
Yeah, if this were a die PO, I would have died like seven times by now. Definitely. Like, these pentagons, they would not be here right now. I just got walled off. Okay. Let's see if I can draw its um, aggro so enough to um, get through. Let's see. Well, it was unnecessary. Oh, it's stuck. Good. And I see that I am finally on the leaderboard. The crazy thing about this game is that just grinding pentagons, it's actually a much safer way to climb than trying to kill people. Because... Well, for starters, everyone has a gun, but that aside, <laughs> um, you don't really have an advantage when everyone has a gun. I mean, my guns have gun. Yeah, my guns have guns. Wait a minute, that's the guy who... And he's too fast, okay. Well, it looks like everyone dies has finally um, been destroyed. That's unfortunate, but everyone has to fall sometimes. Hmm. Nope, I can't, I can't. The one counter to this tank is actually itself, which is pretty broken, honestly, but it kind of just depends on how you build it. Let's see. Will I be a- no, I will not. No, I will definitely not. Yeah, this guy prioritized reload speed over bullet health. He cannot contest this. Oh, hi, Error Ace. What are you doing? I can't believe this guy is still bothering me like this right now. Honestly, like... He's not even faster than me. And yeah, I can say this is definitely one of the most boring moments I've had all night. Let's see. After I destroy this, I'm thinking of ending this video and calling it a night. I have to get ready for work tomorrow. But thanks to most of you for watching. Well, thanks to all of you for watching. I'm really only saying most because that's not counting me. <laughs> I kind of have to watch my videos to edit them. That's how OBS works. But, uh, yeah, I think I'm going to off this tank on a pentagon, just call it a night. Okay, that's it for now. Um, yeah, that's primarily most of what I've got, and let's see. Well, if you like the video, feel free to leave a like, or don't. 
I don't really care. But I hope you have a nice day or nice night wherever you live. <laughs> and uh, maybe I'll see you soon. Bye.